solve the equation 27 to power 2x minus 1 times 1 third to power minus 3x plus 2 equals 9 to power x plus 3. If you look at this equation very well, you will see that we can put both left hand side and right hand side in base 3 to make things easier for us. So, If we put 27 in base 3, we'll have 3 to the power 3, 2x minus 1 times, because of this negative, if I take the negative power of a fraction, is to take the inverse of the fraction. So this will be 3 to the power 3x plus 2. And so if I put this in base 3, this is 3 to the power 2 x plus 3. From laws of indices, product rule, this power can multiply this power. We we'll have 3 to the power 6x minus 3 times 3 to the power 3x plus 2 equals to 3 to the power 2x plus 6. Also, from laws of indices, when we multiply two numbers in the same base, we add their powers. So this will be 3 to the power 6x minus 3 plus 3x plus 2 equals 3 to the power 2x plus 6. 6x plus 3x will be 9x minus 3 plus 2 will be minus 1 equals 3 to the power 2x plus 6. Also, from laws of indices, when we have two numbers in the same base that are equal, their powers have to be equal. So, 9x minus 1 have to be equal to 2x plus 6. So if I add 1 to both sides, I will have 9x equals 2x plus 7. If I subtract 2x from both sides, I will have 9x minus 2x will be 7x equals 7. If I divide both sides by 7, x will be 1. To check if your answer is correct, if you substitute 1 for x in this, you should have the same thing on the right hand side, which is 9 to the power 4. B says differentiate 2x squared plus 5 to the power 4 with respect to s. So what we use here is chain rule because we have a function of a function. The first function is a polynomial and the second function is the power function. So, if y is 2x squared plus 5 raised to the power 4, we can say let the u be 2x squared plus 5. And so if we differentiate u with respect to x, we have 2 times 2 is 4 x subtract 1 from the power which is 1 and if you differentiate a constant it is 0 now x to the power 1 is 1 is x so the u the x is 4x so since it's a chain rule we now have y is equal to u to the power since this is u to the power 4 first to differentiate y which is a which is chain rule it will be dy the x will be the y, the u times the u, the x. If we times this, we'll get the y, the x back. The y, the u, the y, the u is differentiate. If we differentiate this, the y, the u will be 4 times 1 will be 4 u subtract 1 from the power will be 3. So we'll have 4 u to power 3 times the u the x is 4x. If we multiply this, 4 times 4 is 16x. Our u is 2x squared plus 5 raised to the power 3. If it was an OBJ question, we can differentiate it directly. So we take differentiate the outside, which is 4 times this is 4 2x squared plus 5 by 3. This is the actual differentiation 
now differentiate the inside. To differentiate the constant is zero. Differentiate this. This is 4x. And if we multiply, we'll have 16x, 2x squared, plus 5, by 3, which is the same answer. <laughs>